you know, I used to get irritated when people would ask me for documents that I've already given to them over and over and over again. You know, like my cousin Kim Falk Wheatley over there in Dwajak. She keeps repeatedly asking me for documents over and over and over again. Documents I've already showed her, she's already seen, and know that exist. Documents the court has already verified to be true and factual. And I've got all these groups of people running around saying, oh, she won't even show us her paperwork. Don't believe that. That's not true. I've already, I've even told these people, hey, bring some popcorn when you come. We'll look at these videos together and you can help me decide which one will be my favorite. That's real talk. But they want to run around and pretend that I didn't offer anything to them or that I lied or whatever. Don't listen to that malarkey. It's not true. Um, <laughs> The court is, you know, they're very funny about people forging stuff, which is exactly why I'm concerned for uh, the rapist Ronald's family, because I have a feeling they forged a lot of documents, especially with Arquilla, Arquilla Brooks' uh, history of identity theft, along with Patricia Drake's history of welfare fraud. Patricia Lee Drake, welfare fraud out of St. Joe, Michigan. You know Benton Harbor over there? Have a blessed day.